Feature is on UConn baseball player LJ Mazzilli. As John Pearson reports, he's likely following his dad's footsteps right to Major League Baseball. I'm proud of who I am and, and who my dad was. He is a lot like his dad. He is my absolute hero. But much different. You know, everywhere I go, I try to be myself. And first thing I do is introduce myself as LJ and not Lee Jr. Quietly, LJ Mazzilli has gained confidence in himself. It's made the burden of carrying a big league name much easier. It hasn't always been that way. Sometimes I would get the wrong pers perspective on me from other people by, as being maybe conceited or, or someone that doesn't really care about a lot of things, but that was just because I was quiet and, you know, wanting people to take me as I am and not from where I come from. His dad is former big league player and manager Lee. He got his start with the Mets in the 70s. He doesn't tell me anything, you know, he's all about me, all about my sisters, everybody else but himself. Um, people probably wouldn't expect that. Confident and brash as a player, the elder Mazzilli might have been more popular off the field for his big league swagger and good looks. Junior bears a striking resemblance to senior. Well, yeah, yeah right? he's all right. Now he's got some wrinkles. So. <laughs> As for his own skin, LJ has grown comfortable in it. His UConn experience has helped. He did a great job of dealing with that. You know, it's, it's never been Lee Mazzilli Jr., it's LJ. He's realized how to do that and how to balance it over, over time with us. And uh, he's really forged his own identity. Mazzilli has spent four years chipping away at the Huskies' all-time hits lead. He'll finish in the top three. Mazzilli has a career batting average of 340. I just go up there and I want to swing the bat. The best swing that I've ever coached. Hitting has never really been a problem for Mazzilli. It seems he was born to swing the bat. The two areas he's improved the most here at UConn, defense and leadership. I don't want to be a one-dimensional player. I never really, you know, was excited in the field defensively. And now I'm, you know, every single ball that's hit to me, I'm excited to make a play. He knows a lot, just having grown up in a dugout, grown up around it, and he's, he's willing to share that now. I think he was tentative about sharing all that stuff as a freshman and sophomore and maybe uh, felt as though it wasn't his place, but now we need him to do that. You gotta be proud of who you are and where you come from, and I wanna make people proud, especially my family. I'm John Pearson, News 8 Sports.